The apparent resurrection has been signed by religious leaders, human rights groups, and Virtue 100 company CEOs. This is an abomination born of unchecked vanity, technocratic arrogance, complete moral collapse. Our position is clear. Suburo Arasaka's seizure of power is in violation of international law. International arbitration is absolutely necessary to... Do we really want to live in a world where the rich and powerful can become immortal? Where they can continue to take from the poor? Not only their livelihoods, but even their bu- You are gods! You are gods! You are gods! You are gods! Life is not for trade! Life is not- But Saburo Arasaka has issued his response in similarly strong terms. There will be no appeasement. Arasaka Shanaibu no dekigoto ni kanshite. Gaibu no katagata ni toyaka to iwareru sujiai wa arimasen.性を受けることに許可が必要ない以上、蘇ることも同様であると考えるべきです。私が息子を殺めたなどという主張は事実無根。法的根拠もありません。合意の上での身体の譲与は一種の寄付に分類することができ、殺人には到底値しません。殺人
Really aced it last time, didn't I? Slow walk. Not bad so far, huh? Try a little faster. Accelerate by three. I... I can't. Gotta stop. Stop treadmill. Hm. Testing concluded for today. Communications have been unlocked. You may now phone home. Earth. Hello? Well, about damn time, V. Been trying to reach you for days now. I had a lot on my mind. A lot going on. What the hell happened to you? Got the chip out of my head. No, really? You're joking. No, just had the procedure. Not feeling so hot. Where are you? Orbital station. Arasaka's. <laughs> Think I'm gonna puke. V, you idiot. Get back down to Earth now. Doctor up here's a real cunt, let me tell you. Torturing me with stupid tests all the time. Don't take anything they give you. Nothing. Might sound cliche, but it feels like they're hiding something. Okay, enough. Get a grip. Grab a shuttle and get your ass back home. You know, I think I might be losing my mind. Oh, fuck. This place, it's killing me. V, you even hear what you're saying? I mean, Arasaka. You let him take you into orbit, dig around in your head, and now you think to complain? It's so good to hear your voice. I'm just... I'm so glad you're here. There. Fuck me. I thought you were dead. I don't know what I'll do if I ever find out you're gone. Really want to see you again. I'm gonna hang up. And I want to see you back on Earth. In hours. No. Now. How's it going? Hey, think I ought to ask you the same. Got rid of the biochip. Arasaka do it? Yep. Sitting on their orbital station. All right. So once you get back, pay me a visit, huh? You're gonna need a thorough checkup. How's Misty? Well, after you left, she went off to visit her folks. For a while, most likely. Got a postcard from her. From Warsaw. There's a polar bear on it. Tell her I said hi when she gets back. You'll tell her yourself. Yeah, so to be honest, been better. But what am I supposed to do long distance over the phone? I just wanted to talk, Vic. 
Look, we go back long enough that you know I'm no good at this stuff. And Misty's out of town. What am I supposed to do? Get a grip. Make a decision. You already showed yourself and me. You can do it. <sighs> Thanks for the pep talk, Vic. Sounds like a plan. Hey. Hey, uh, bad time. Can I wait? Just wanted to talk. Sorry, like I said, bad time. I have to call you back. Hey. Hey. Wow, it's been a while since I heard that voice. How's things at your end? I'm in the middle of a meeting with Mitch. He wants me to hang up. He's signaling wildly. Tell him to get lost. Tell him I said that. He says hello. To you and your venerable mother. Listen, I'm stuck in a shithole. It sucks. Hard. So leave the shithole. Come home. Not that simple. No is a nice word. Beautiful sometimes. You should use it more often. Sorry, Mitch is about to blow a fuse. I'll have to call you back. Hey. Hey, V. Look, um, season finale of Little Big Corporal Rats is on in a minute, so, uh, call you back later, huh? Okay. Yeah, never mind. Have fun. Will do. See ya. Cognitive function test. Solve the cube. Saburo Arasaka and NUS President Rosalind Myers have agreed to meet in person to lay the groundwork for a lasting peace. A first step of goodwill was taken today as the Arasaka CEO withdrew from Night City 15 armored vehicles from the company. Hey, listen. These tests gonna go on much longer. We need very precise data. I can't stand this anymore.
cognitive function test. Solve the cube. Place it up. Respond to the key words. No thinking, just the first word that comes to mind. Loyalty. Me. Please respond to each term with the first thing that comes to mind. Quick as I can, no thinking, right? Humanity. Me. Please step onto the treadmill. As quickly as you can, without thinking about it. V. Hanako Arasaka. I want to talk to her. No. Cognitive function test. Solve the cube. Shit, it worked. You look just as you did when I found you in the rubbish. Get up. Takamura. <laughs> Blunt as usual. They say you demanded someone tell you the truth. They have kept you here in this cell? For days? It is barbaric. Come all the way here to take me home? They asked me to speak with you. Sasaburo Arasaka's back. And you are Nobu's body. Yes. Justice has been done. So, got your revenge? Feel satisfied? I believe Hanako Arasaka chose the best solution. You know, the Arasakas belong in some sad old tragedy. Some Shakespeare-level shit there. Your Nobu especially. You regret his fate? Wanted out of his dad's shadow, whatever the cost. Died at the hand of his worst nightmare. What are you gonna do now? Still aim to protect Saburo's ass? I have been transferred to Japan. I will fly from here to Takamatsu. Why? New times, new duties. But we say far too much about me. Fine. So what is it you gotta tell me? I am sorry to say it is not good. I will be blunt. The surgery did not help. You will be dead before winter. How? How is that possible? Arsaka's got the best and brightest. No, no. The operation was a success, and that is why. But the changes the chip made were too great, even for the corporate neurosurgeons. This is fucking Arasaka. They should figure something out. You must accept the truth, then listen to what I say. There are options. Dead in a few months. That's me, huh? You will feel better at first, but then the illness will grow fierce, attack in full force. Your final weeks, you will spend in bed. Fuck. Please, feel no anger. I wish to speak about an alternative. Said Arasaka would fix me if I helped you, you promised. 
I believe truly they could. Said you had powerful friends. Where are those friends now? I did not come with empty hands. We must speak about your options. Hanako Arasaka promised to save my life. It is the reason she sent me here. To discuss the alternative. What are you talking about? Trusted you all once already. You let me down. You may join the Secure Your Soul program. Hanako Arasaka has agreed to it. You will leave your body. Arasaka will store your engram in Mikoshi until a way is found to transfer it to a new body. Store? Can't I get a new body right off? With technology as it is now, this is impossible. Seemed pretty damn possible for Saburo Arasaka. He returned in his son's body. Tissue compatibility made things easier. Yet your phenotype, thanks to the chip, is unique. Arasaka cannot provide a suitable body at this time. Sorry, not buying it. Arasaka's out to lock me up. You overstate your importance. To the Arasakas, I fear you are nobody, war nobody. With this offer, Hanako Arasaka rewards you generously for your service. There's not, as you say, more to the story. Nope. Doesn't sound good to me at all. I agree to this, and they'll do whatever they want with me. There will be a contract to protect you. Sign it, and you will live. It is written here that you relinquish all rights, but do not worry. The law is simply behind the times, and Ingram is not legally a person. So I get to be corporate property first? Like many brain dance stars and politicians from what I know, the program is a success. There have been no complaints. And if I say no? This is not a prison. You will take your things and return to Night City. Why are you? I would sign. But the choice is yours. Think it through carefully. Don't want to die. A good choice. The Engram station is ready for you. We should not wait for your condition to worsen. Gonna see each other again? I believe we will. So... See you. Visit me in Kagawa. I will show you what is real food. Hey, what's your name? Hajime. Hajime, let me ask you something. What would you say to a person who walked right into their greatest foe's jail to save their life? Hmm, I would say, all right, but do not forget the way home.
How's the Earth looking from way up there? She as pretty as they say? Or is that just another lie? Listen, don't forget, your implants were made for Earth gravity. Could start acting up in orbit. What I'm trying to say is, don't ignore any error warnings, okay? And when you're back, I mean, if you come back, I'll do a full checkup. Maybe even give you a little discount. Take care, V. Hey, V. Everyone's telling me you're a, a base gordo now. A big shot, eh? <laughs> so big you can't call me once a week. Once a month, even. Don't forget where you started. Who you started with, hmm? My door's always open to you, V. There's always food on my table. Mi casa es su casa. No se te olvide. Ahí te veo, V. Hey, v. I'm just, uh, I'm calling to say goodbye. I finally decided to up and leave this city for good. Realize this place only gives you two choices. You either become an asshole, or eventually you get off by one. I hope you somehow find an alternative. It's just a shame things had to end this way. Have a nice life, V. Hello, V. How are things? Weather in the Badlands is pleasant as usual. My cooler melted, it's 90 degrees in the shade, and there's sandstorms heading straight for us. So yeah, you're missing out. No, but seriously. We're doing all right. Saul and I somehow get along, for better or for worse. But still, family's always growing, work's always piling up. But better to keep busy, right? And to think if it wasn't for you, I'd still be stumbling my way through Night City. So I just want to say thank you. For all you've done for me. I'd still be lost if you hadn't set me on the right track. Alright, well, talk soon, V. Don't be a stranger. Hello, V. Um, Saul speaking. Heard about something big happening in Night City, with a certain V in the lead role. Uh, don't know what you plan to do now, but just remember, we always take care of our own. And, um, you're one of us now, V. You're an Aldo Caldo. Remember that. Ah, take care of yourself, V. And see you around. V, hey! Can you hear me? Shit, is this thing recording? Okay, well, all of us have been wondering when you're finally gonna drop by. We can get a barbecue going, knock a few back, do a couple of races, or pay a friendly visit to the Raff and Shiv. Guess what I'm trying to say is, well, Badlands could use a badass like you, V. Don't know what you got on your plate right now, but remember, you're welcome out here anytime. All right, now, take care. Hey, Rogue here. I wanted to... Oh, voicemail. <laughs> Why not? V? I was wondering if you could pass a message along to Johnny. Two messages, actually. One, that he's an arrogant, egotistical son of a bitch. And second, that it was nice to talk to him again. Both of you, take care of yourselves, okay? Hey, V, 
So, funny thing just happened. Oh, fuck, fuck, shit. The voicemail again. Do you ever answer the phone? Like, ever? Seriously. I can get through to data term customer service faster than you. What did I even want? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You know that us cracks agent called me and asked if I would go on tour with them. At first, I was like, oh, my dead fucking body. But then I thought, hey, wait. I could actually be fun. So, uh, who knows? Well, there's the latest gossip for you, if you even care. Call me back when you can, okay? Bye! B, hey. So, here's the thing. A couple fellas from the 5th Precinct busted a shop selling illegal iron. Sawed-offs, stun guns, mustard gas canisters. Orders from on up were to blow it all to the ground. But then I thought, maybe there's a better way to use all this stuff for a good cause. I still remember what you did for us. For me and Randy. The city needs more people like you. And I'm gonna make sure they're equipped. This one's on me, V. See you around. V? Jefferson Perales here. You know, mayor of Night City. I'm calling about our recent program to tackle homelessness. What would you say about being the head of my security detail, huh? As you know, the number of people I can trust are few and far between. Next week we're gonna be raising the city's taxes. So, things might get a little hairy. Come by, we'll hammer out a good deal for you. I'm no any pincher when it comes to safety. Alright, well... We'll be in touch, V. Hey, V. Orbital connections cost an arm and a leg, so I'll just get right to it. I was just thinking about you, so I laid out a quick tarot and... Oh, dear. The fool... The moon, the high priestess. Those, uh, those are bad cards. Keep a close eye on your new friends, V. I mean it. Cause we lost everything. We had to pay the price. See me, you're like 